Today is 10th December. 66 years ago on this day, we the peoples of the nations created the Universal Declaration of Human Rights to hold ourselves accountable to the principles of freedom, peace and justice for all. December 10 is also a day of pride for citizens of India. We were not only among the first countries to ratify the declaration, but we were also one of the 19 countries to draft it. Hansa Mehta, a very well-known social activist from Gujarat, was part of the team that drafted this declaration that starts by asserting that all human beings are born equal in dignity and rights. In fact, she is credited for amending the language of the Article 1 of this declaration from all men are created equal to all human beings are born equal. Having said that, the human rights record of our nation, sorry to say, remains appalling. Abuse by police and armed forces including arbitrary arrest and detentions, disappearances, extrajudicial killings, rape, death and torture in custody continue as I speak. We are still governed by patriarchal mores and mindsets as a result of which rape, domestic violence, dowry related deaths, honor killings, sexual harassment and discrimination against women remain serious problems. Child abuse, bonded labor, forced and early marriages, trafficking of children and adults for prostitution are widespread. Caste-based discrimination and violence, discrimination against indigenous persons, discrimination and violence based on gender identities, discrimination against persons with disabilities in HIV and AIDS remain rampant. Many choose to look the other way even when they know of gross human rights violations. Many just don't care enough to find out. But many like us at Video Volunteers are committed to expose it and amplify the voices of those defending our rights. You can be a human rights defender too. All you have to do is empathize, speak out and stand by those speaking out. So support the grit and determination of thousands of us social activists, academics, lawyers, journalists, filmmakers, college students, farmers and workers. Join us in our spirited struggle against inhumanity and injustice. Let's fulfill our commitment to justice, peace and democracy. We observe the Human Rights Day today, but clearly we need to safeguard and strengthen the principles of human rights on all 365 days of the year, 24 by 7. Thank you for listening.